Welcome to SWK's video series on Sage 100. This video is going to show you how to adjust an accounts payable invoice that has already been posted. We're going to do, go to um, Invoice Data Entry in the main menu of Accounts Payable, and I'm going to bring up a vendor whose invoice I need to adjust. If I put in an existing invoice number, I'm going to get a little note, this invoice is already on file. But note what's in the bottom left corner, Adjust. If I click on this, it's going to show me the invoice balance down in, in this a field where you cannot change it, and the adjustment amount is either going to be the plus or the minus of how this invoice needs to be adjusted. Of course, I'm going to have to come in and I'm going to um, have to assign the account numbers or account numbers. And then I simply accept and update and pretty much everything is done for me. Let's go ahead and get this updated and then we're going to take a peek at the invoice. Here's my, here's my report that you could see. Uh, let's make that a little bigger so you could see it. Um, and you could see that it's, um, it is going to the account number. It is for only the amount of the adjustment and it's giving me an alert that it's an adjustment. Let's go ahead and update. And by the way, I also have this set up to automatically adjust the daily ta uh, transaction register. You notice I didn't have to go through a second series of prompts. Let's go to the vendor's account and let's go find that invoice. Here it is. What you'll see uh, down in the uh, uh, secondary grid, we see the original invoice, but then we also see the adjustment. So now I could see that my amount that's showing up in the primary grid is the net of the two amounts. Give this a try. Hope this helps you get more out of Sage 100. Thank you for watching.